Hey guys, how's it going? March the 13th, 2022, and we are back live. First day of daylight savings time on run eight, so a little bit brighter in our evening. Figure it was a good day to run some trains, and also figured it was a good day to, uh, since Emmett uh, wanted to run an intermodal train, because, you know, he wanted something pretty laid back and fast and everything. I thought today would be a good day to uh, to do a little bit of a like a tutorial since I did a guide last night on switching. First of all, uh, let me just double check here if uh, everything is going. Looks like we're good. You didn't replace the uh, picture. I didn't replace the picture. Ah. Yeah, this button turn on. What the hell? Okay, well I'll replace the picture. I will replace the picture then, because I thought I did. So let me replace the picture. Make it happy. Okay. There we go. The picture has been replaced. And if you don't see it, that's okay. So, let me, uh, let me start by, um, there's a, there's a lot of ways that when you come on to the server, um, you're going to see now now this this will work this is a good tutorial for those that are first running on um or first running on actually you know something well, i'm on the middle am i in the siding right now i'll tell you what i'll do i'm going to relinquish this we're going to start from scratch now if he already had a train you can do the same thing you can have it turn ai you can have it go relinquished you can do all kinds of things uh, let's let's say this train was AI'd, for example. So we're going to pretend everything was AI'd. What that means is AI is is taking control of this train, and the dispatcher is going to start doing some things, but they're changing some of the routing now because I kind of screwed them up because they were going to fly me through. But because I was waiting to do live stream, it decided I didn't want to. So, on RTS we have the Mojave sub and we have Barstow. We do not have needles or any of the other um, routes. So you don't have to worry about that. You don't have to worry about uh, download content or anything like that. You, you can just run. There's a list of things that we have if you're interested. Now this guy's coming to a green light, right? Say I want to take him over. So I click on him and relinquish when stop, but I also ask him to stop. So stop and hold. So now he is he is going to stop. You'll notice and you can zoom in with the mouse wheel. Um, you can see the uh, green signal here. Watch. You'll see here what happens. This was the uh, start of two meets coming out of uh, needles there. So the signal's gone red. It is now available to be taken. What I normally do, it, just to be precaution, sometimes it works. Sometimes it, it sometimes it works just by going in and starting. I always like to go in, do an auto start, auto MU, auto control, auto AB, auto e EOT. That gives you everything. Uh, if you have a rail driver, great. I can't tell you the keyboard commands because I have no idea. It's been too long. I can tell you the keyboard commands outside a rail driver, but other than that, I can't tell you. My headlights are on, all that other stuff. This is a domestic container train. It's going to North Bay, which is north. No, the container train Tyler has a... Uh, oh, we got some intermold on the back. Okay, cool. We're tying up that. we're tying up traffic because we're yapping. That's okay. Starting so the you click on the the lead unit, you control F eleven is the key is the standard key command to get in. Actually, I can I can stop looking at that and then just go control F11. Okay. You want to make sure everything is neutral or else nothing will work. And then you put it in forward. Oh, I should show you something else first. So, uh what was I going to do? On my website or on the website you will get something with sheets. This will tell you some of the locals. So if you want to run, if you want to run switching, I've shown you some of the switching jobs. Uh, just look, uh, there was one I did last night on 
Um, you can run various yards. You can run with other people. If you feel a little uncomfortable with running, right now you can take a look and there's um, uh, Switcher is, well, he's not running anything at the moment. Yes, he is. He's running a BNSF engine. So you can transport to him and go see what he's doing. Uh, if nobody's on, don't fear. You can use the Discord and uh, post a message and you know, you'll, you'll find out when people come on. Uh, the server runs daily between 7 a.m. and 11 p.m., Monday to Friday, and on weekends we, we start later. Hey, King, how's it going? So King is uh, a regular user of our, ours as well. There are people here that will help you out. Uh, so if you're a new user, don't worry about that. You're not going to break anything if, you know, yeah. I mean, Emmett, Emmett went through a red signal earlier. I, I, I didn't ground him. So, it's okay. He didn't break anything. Heck, I ran into a train today at 10 miles an hour. I did. <laughs> I was lucky. I was lucky. Cars too. I derailed a couple cars, yes. I've done that. I really wish that was on YouTube. I know, I, know, I know people who are railroaders who have gone through red signals in this. We know who he is. I know. Oh, I dropped my mouse because it was so funny. Um, where is it? He's embarrassed about that one. He don't like to be reminded about that, but that's okay. I like to remind him because it's fun. Um, it's okay. It's only a game. Um, it's not like real life. And doing other things, watching the cat or letting the dog out, you know, taking a leak. It's all okay. So anyways... We're here. We're going to take this train. This is what we want. I highly recommend if you haven't run trains, run an intermodal. Um, the reason why is this factor right here, this HPT, you want it high. The manifest will be two point something usually or low three. Yeah. They're going to give you more difficulty. These are going to go faster, but you don't have to run the speed limit. You can run below the speed limit. It's better that you run below than above the speed limit. Yeah, Think bad things happen. You mean me, sir? Because I bulldozed or Scott and Mojave. Yes! No, you went right through them, didn't you? Oh, my back is killing me this weekend. Anyways. Uh, if you don't like this little uh, heat lamp here, you can turn him off. Oh, that's a attendant call? That's, no, that's not it. Where is it? Cabin light. And the step lights, we don't need those yet. It's still light out. It's daylight savings time. The sun hasn't set yet. It's 9 p.m. at night. Huh? It's 9 p.m. at night in the east and 6 p.m. at... Yeah, it's starting to set. That's okay. We'll, we'll have... We, we have fun. We're talking about 9 p.m.? 9 p.m.? Oh, it's time to go. Oh, can you give me a snack before you leave? That's Emmett's... Uh, here, here you go. Here's a, here's a drink cup. Thanks, bud. Yeah, I can see the sun. So anyways, with all that said, we're in forward. Give it a notch. I had independent brakes on. I'm taking them off. And, of course, we got a red signal. So, well, that kind of sucks, right? What do you do? What do you do about the red signal? Um, our server is run. Ah, man, we got a lot of trains out there tonight. Hopefully, we don't have any trains. Uh, yeah, I'm going to want more trains, so I upped the uh, levels a bit. And I already clogged the, the lines a bit. So if notch one doesn't take off, then notch two will probably give it to you. Make sure your parking brake is off. There, the EOT is moving. That's a that's that's good enough for now. Alright. Thanks, buddy. Love you. Oh, you got my cell phone? Yeah, it's right there. Oh, just behind. Okay. Oh, okay, you can grab it to me. Yeah, yeah, I'll take it. Thank you, buddy. I love you. Love you too. See ya. See ya. Bye. Bye bye. So Emmett has a lot of fun with this. So, hey, Christopher. So yeah, we're gonna we're gonna have fun, some fun. I want I want to be very welcoming to new people. Um, you know, sometimes I've been, you know, very serious when I was a little, a little younger. I wanted to do things very prototypically and all that. So it's it's, it's not that I was being personal. I just I liked my trains, um, and I liked my prototypical stuff. So, anyways, let's. Let's just uh, we'll keep it in neutral here for a minute. How do you call the dispatcher? His name is Otto. He screws up. 
but it's okay. So we're in Hinkley. You can tell by that, by the train. Well, you'll just know where you are because you're going to say transport. Or you want to transport to someplace. You want to see this guy in the siding just waiting for us. Or, see, that's him. So you hit the space bar where you're at. And then we hit the space bar here. That's us coming up to the signal. You want to get back in. Click on that. Control F11. And we're fine. We'll give it another notch. We need to call the dispatcher to do that. It says channel 14, you don't need to go to channel 14. Don't worry about that crap. What you need to do is hit DTMF star five, four. Hello? Hello? You're not working. Is it a different channel? Oh, it's star 13. We're on BNSF. That's right. Oops. BNSF's down here. There was nobody answering. Okay. Request an exciting. You can try that if you want doesn't work half the time for me so don't worry about that but we'll try it later maybe we want to request a signal we want to get out of here now what I usually do uh, you can do shift Z or if you got a rail driver you can go up and I usually like looking at this thing you can keep hitting shift Z to, so I gotta proceed on signal indication I don't know what that signal is I can't see it yet if you're blind and you don't know. There it is. We got a green. All right, we're good. This will tell us that we are. Our last signal was a diverging approach that put us into the siding, and our track speed is now 40 miles an hour. So I just notched it up to notch three, and I want to shove some food in my mouth. So actually, I'll do that once we get up to speed, and I'll shove some food in my mouth, and I'll be very rude. So, see that amp meter right over here? This is key. This is how I do it. I'm not a professional. When it starts backing off, you can go to about a thousand amps. You're on, you're on flat land. So watch what happens. See the amps go up? You don't want to you don't want to just keep on going like all the way to notch 8. I mean, the intermodal could probably handle it. I usually wait till it goes down and starts settling. Now it's going down fairly quick. There. See it settles? Notch 5. That's how I do it. The reason why this is called run eight is because you only got eight notches. Aha, isn't that clever? And, uh, yeah. And the sun's going down. I'm in a good mood today. Had a great weekend. Doing a lot of train running. Hey, Christopher. Did I say hi to you? I don't know if I did or not. So, yeah, don't be shy. If you break it, Somebody will help you fix it. If you're not sure, just run. No. Just post a message, say, I broke something, I'm sorry. It's okay. We'll try to teach you how to fix it next time. But if you break it, we'll know you broke it because you're in the logs. So we're up to about 642. All right, notch eight. Okay, our track speed's 40. It, it's going to climb quite a bit in a minute. So I'm gonna try to shove some food in my mouth. Watch the speedometer. I'll also watch uh, this train track speed. I should have used a counter coming out of that siding, but I didn't. There's a reason for that. See the speedometer? Starting to get up to 40. You can back it up as fast as you want. Oh, the track speed's changed to 70. Forget I said that. Now I can I can go pretty quick back up to where I was because we have the same the same amount of power already in there. 
you already had that that forward torque, right? Now there's some interesting tools that will help you. Yeah, if you want to look around, you got arrows. You can look at the pretty sun. You can. I I have the window open. You can close it too if you don't like it. If you're cold, uh, press control on the right. You can push the arrow. You can see the desert. There's a lot of desert. There's some nice mountains. Whoops. Now, see that little red thing that's flashing? You can uh, hit a alerter button, or you can move a throttle. You can do some other things. Some people suggest putting tape on it. I don't think it works. If you want to put tape, some tape on your keyboard, that's up to you. I can, I'm can. i not putting tape on my rail driver. Okay, you're coming up to a signal. The reason why you also know is next signal is 0 0.2 miles. Here it is. Green means go. Keep going. The faster you go, the more times you're going to have to hit that thing. Unless you're doing stuff. That helps my garbage bin. Yeah, well, let's throw it in the bag here. Yeah, okay. My back is sore. Mm. So I can you can look at the F3. Whoops. Be careful when you do that too. You can look at the F3. I try not to do that. I think it's cheating. It's good to look to every now and then, especially when you're stopped and waiting. Just to see what's happening. But when you're moving, then you can check to make sure other trains are moving around, what the traffic looks like moving up ahead. Kind of give you an idea. Now remember that you could you could request you can request the siding, uh, the next siding. You can cancel your clearance. You can do all kinds of things with auto. He can get nasty with you if you keep bugging him. It's just John's uh, dry humor. I have dry humor too, so. Uh, if it's raining and you want to use the, the windshield wipers, you just hit the V button. You can hit that a few times, or you can just play around with it if you if you like to, if you're really bored. There we go. Oh, I guess the windshield wiper doesn't count as an alerter button. I didn't know that. The more you know. Good evening, Divius. Are you supposed to be Devious or Divius? Okay. That's cool. Divius too. Another green signal. So the advantage of having an intermodal train is uh, you get to go pretty fast. Passenger trains you can get to go uh, faster too. We only have a couple, but... Everybody wants to run them, and they work right now. The problem with the problem with it is uh, we don't have the cajon sub anymore, so and we don't have the needle sub, so <laughs> it's pretty useless. Some people don't like that, but you know. So seventy six eighty five. You're waiting for one train. It just said, is, "Are we seventy six eighty five? Yes, we are. So Otto's telling us. That we're waiting for one train. That's nice of Auto. Auto can be nice too, as long as you don't bug them. Now this thing doesn't beep at you, unfortunately. I wish it would. Some people used to get annoyed by that, but it is what it is. So we gotta wait for one train. Now we can, now we can uh, take a look and see. Ah, oh, yeah. So we got one train coming up, and then uh, it looks like smooth sailing for a while there. 
until we get flying out uh, west of Mojave. So I'm not doing too much. I can I can play around with with the uh, different uh, orbiting. AWSD moves around. W gets you closer. Control F11 get you back in. Oh yeah, honk for those. Too long. One short. One long. Wink. Turn your belt off. Oh, two medium, I think it is. Two medium, one short, one long. I think that's what it is. I don't know. It works pretty good. It's a medium or long. I usually find the last one is longer. That's just me. DV, DVS2. That's a, that's a detector, so you, you can hit the counter on that. The counter uh, counts down your train backwards, and it's uh, it's this thing that's counting down. Every engine's different, so uh, this is counting down here. Some of them some of them show up in here. Now, if you got something wrong with your train, he'll tell you to stop. If you don't. Last night I was fixing my own stuff. There wasn't a detector that was telling you it. There's there's other ways of finding out that things are wrong with it. Your uh, tags will light up pink if you have tags on. Here we don't need tags because we're not switching this train. Now watch, it just beeped. I don't know if that was us. I think it was us. I don't know. Okay, we're coming up to another signal. Stick your head out the window, get some air. So if we are in fact doing prototypical, we do it in the real way. You get a hot box on a unit. Can you set it out? I let it cool down. I find it cools down within a minute or two. I wouldn't worry about it. I mean, put it this way, my my the way I look at it, Quincy is if the sim is set up prototypically to allow that I would say yes but it's not really so because it's not I treat all of them as fixable that's just me if you want to set them out knock yourself out I wouldn't worry about it the alerter beeps for me I let it go a little bit longer to hear it yeah you can do that too Before, we never used to have the little flashing warning. Version 3, we, we started to get the flashing warning, so that was cool. See, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll go with what uh, King Bond says in the chat here. So watch this. Feels like a bomb's going to go off. There, now I hit it. If I didn't hit it, then there would be a penalty break. The brakes would start applying, the train would come to a stop. So right now uh, it shows a grade of plus 0.55%. That's why I'm not going full speed, uh, despite having a 70 mile an hour, uh, 70 mile an hour uh, thingamajig speed limit. Got 43 loads, no empties. Now we got a funny signal up here. The reason why I say it's a funny signal is because it's. What am I doing that for? Oh, I don't know why I was zoomed. It's funny looking because it's got two lights that are bright. So it's probably a double yellow. 
I think it's an approach medium. See, and this thing, this thing cheats and tells you before the signal, so that that's that means you're going into a siding. But we already knew that. This thing will cheat. If you like cheating a little bit and you're new, this is pretty cool. I use it anyways. I, I, I like knowing where the next signal is going to be and what the track speed is if I missed it. Um, man, I almost look like approach restricting. Approach medium. Okay, guess what? See the alerter? I'm not going to hit the alerter. I'm just going to slow down. See? It acts the same way. Pretty cool, huh? It's all you do on the server. You don't have to talk to anybody if you want. If you want to chat, you can say... I just let hot boxes cool down. There we go. So what it does when you chat, it has your name. By the way, when you're coming onto the server, you want to have, uh, where is, hold on, I don't even have my menu in here. Where is my menu? No, oh, my menu's not working right now. My menu is not working. I don't know. It's borderless full screen. I've had that happen before, where just my menu just goes away. I forget how to fix that. Anyways, I was going to change my name in the menu, but we don't need our menus right now. You can look in the manual for that stuff. So I got to get to 40 miles an hour, so this is why I'm reducing my speed. Uh, this thing right here. That uh, this thing now it changes with every engine. Every engine has different things. Uh, I don't know what this engine's called. It's a funny engine. Let's see. I'll tell you. Let's let's see here. Okay, we're gonna, we're in ES44 DC. That's it. Okay, beautiful. Like if I care, I call this the old engine. I like I like the newer engines. The uh, SD70s, they're nice. So there's our signal up ahead. So we're going to get down to 40. If you're going a little bit above it, it ain't going to kill you. Might derail you, but... It's very forgiving, put it that way. There we go. So the beautiful thing about this in comparison to other sims you might have seen or you're used to. Everything's not at a script. The trains, everything right now is so random. Uh, sometimes it's too random for my liking. I like schedule, but anyways, we'll, we'll see, maybe one day. So that's uh, diverging approach, red, yellow. See, even tells you, in case you don't know the signal. Once you get past the signal head, I hit the counter. What that tells me is my tail end is now clear. And I see a train right here. And he's coming up, so it looks like we're going to have a running meet. Exciting. Just brought the game and reading the PDFs that come with it, and it's confusing me as of right now. Don't worry about it. Take your time. There's a lot of things you don't have to worry about. I'll tell you that right now. Just get in. I, you know, don't worry about busy bar. You can go into busy bars still, um, and just pick some trains and have fun. But uh, come on, as you know, come on to a server. Come ride with somebody. I got to, I downloaded a few packs today. I, I downloaded pack two and pack three, as well as uh, the forty foot packs. Even though I, I'm not running any forty footies right now, uh, let's see. See, I don't have that beep, so I almost missed it. Before you went live, there was a quay of uh, of aces going up in the hill in Kalenti. Yeah, that's cool. 
Yeah, I was I, I was on I was I was broadcasting. Emmett Emmett ran from uh, needles. He ran from needles up to uh, he got he got stalled by two trains. So I can look ahead and see I got a green light. So that's called that's what you call a running meet. Now I got to get down to forty anyways. I don't know. I, I should have stayed at 40. I'm actually speeding. Oh, I gotta show something. Look at the desert. Yes. Behave. <laughs> That's Scott in the chat. Forcing me to moderate. All his, uh... I don't know why I have to moderate that. He's got a, the star. I guess you can't even... I guess you can't even pretend to... Um, it doesn't like the SH star T. Anyways, if you want to drive right in, come in the server and I'll take you on a check ride and show you the outs. Yes, you can. Anybody. You can ride with anybody. I have, I have a Discord. I have a Discord. You can come in. You can use, uh, these are the, the voice public channels. You can you can use this one here. Talk to anybody. Chat with anybody you want. Uh, you know, pretty friendly group here. We're small. That's why I don't have needles. There's people that hey, I like Cajon. I love Cajon. I like the Northeast. I like the Southeast. There's, there's all kinds of things that I like. Uh, but the biggest thing I like doing is providing a service and just running a system and knowing I can run it that's the thing I can do this in single player it's a much more fun when you got other people so once I get out of that siding I forgot to put the counter on coming out I was too busy uh, moderating uh, stuff here but uh, once you come out See King Bond, he's just coming in. He was in the chat. So Chubby Turtles in there, Quincy's in there, Switcher's in there. Scott's just being a shit disturber. Uh, <laughs> Scott's eyes hurt or something. I don't know. He's 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 fallen and he's gotten he can't get up. Guy this poor guy. Goes outside in his pajamas, almost freezes to death. Scott, Scott and Quincy have been with me since uh, the beginning, like 10 years, almost 10 years now. I wasn't in Run 8 for two years. Version 3 brought me back. And it's, and it's good to be back. Hey, guess what? I just AI, uh, AI recruited a train. Well, that was quick. LOL. What was that? <laughs> See, I miss the chats. We need our beeps back. I miss that. Sounds like a good idea. There you go. Yeah, our server, our server is open from 7 a.m. Uh, just past 7 a.m. I wake up at 7 a.m. So uh, usually about 7:05 or so, uh, I, I flip the server on. On weekends, I sleep in, and then uh, like tonight, I will shut her down at 11. So Sunday through Thursday night, I'll shut it down at 11. Friday night, I stay up a little later. That's usually my pattern. So on the weekends, I will... I will go later, blah, blah, blah. Uh, if I'm on Discord on the weekends, I usually will broadcast on Discord. You can usually find me in the public chat. I usually am not available, uh, the voice chat. I'm usually, I keep everything off. I don't really like talking that much except unless it's just doing what I'm doing right now I'm a little shy oh shoot I'm at 70 mi miles an hour I can't talk and uh, concentrate at the same time apparently too Noah yeah, sure, no problem. 
I mean, you can you can you can run something within thirty minutes. I mean, you could take a train like the way it's packed right now. If you look at, um, I mean, yeah, I mean, we really got it. the Mojave sub is packed tonight. This is the kind of thing that we used to see, and then it just cleared up in Marcel. I got a, I got a clear shot to Mojave. It looks like right now. But um, we used to have, and if uh, I had one earlier where the trains were stopped, if if you find that, then by all means, delete a train. Anything that's important is usually going to be uh, a manifest. Try not to delete the manifest. Turtle, you on? Yeah, he's on. I saw him. He dare. He's just not doing anything. What time zone? I'm in Chicago. I'm in Eastern Eastern Daylight Time. So you are right now 8.26 Daylight Eastern uh, Daylight Time. Daylight Time is of today. Whistle posts are measured for 60 miles an hour in most cases. So you just fraction it out and... We get a nice sunset tonight. Now it was raining in uh, Mojave earlier, so I don't know if it's still raining in Mojave. Don't look like it. But I don't know how far we can see ahead. Cause I know it was ra it was definitely raining in Mojave earlier. I don't know if I reset did I reset the server? No, that was uh Don't I have a rent a conductor? No. I don't know what it is sometimes. I don't get a rent a conductor. I don't know how to do that. If you want to have some guy sitting beside you, you can. I don't know how to do it though. And my menus aren't working right now for some stupid reason. But that's okay. F4 gives you... Oh, there it is. Hey, I got it back. Okay. So, yeah. If you go to train, crew avatar... Yeah, Jesus Murphy. Oh, I lost it again, you bugger. Why is that doing that? Crew avatars, uh-oh. So, I got auto-generate conductor. Or no. Enable rent a conductor. It's on. Why don't I have one? I don't know. So yeah, we're Eastern Daylight Time. And if you're not sure, this might help. This is the actual time while well, that's stuff coming up, so... This is I don't know what it'll show up on your sheets. I'm trying I'm trying to find out what you guys see. If that translates into yours or whatever. But uh, for example, the the current time, if you just hit the delete key on the sheets, you, know, you probably don't have access to it. So if you don't, you hit refresh. The uh, the server time right now is 628, 629. The current time is 929 Eastern Daylight Time. So that's that's one way of finding out. The sheets can be accessed at Discord. It is not mandatory to have them. If you're just running mainline trains, you know, we used to have a registry back in version one and two. We don't do that. We do it we, we do require some record keeping if you're in Barstow. Uh, Sean, why uh, tra tra transfer is ready? Okay. Cool. So that's uh, that's a transfer job.
So yeah, uh, King, uh, I don't know if you're doing bar... Yeah, yeah, he got it. There it is. He likes doing Barstow, so... So, what he's probably going to be looking at... These guys know their stuff. We go into Schedule Manifest. So this one was due out like half an hour ago. Um, it doesn't go out on the same time. He probably is going to be working on that. Oh yeah, there's also... There is also some engines uh, in departure. But you'll probably need more. So, if you're just running trains, you don't have to worry about chatting and all this other stuff. You can say hi. If you don't, it's okay. The chat doesn't work that well very much. And if you want to go on Discord, uh, check, uh, just say, uh, just go into, uh, t t go in tab, type in, uh, does anybody want to, t um, chat with me on Discord, help me on Discord, or something like that. People will help you. I'm a little shy. I don't normally do that. That's just me. But, who knows? You never know. Never say never. But we'll, we'll find a way to help you. Sometimes we're a little busy doing different things. Like tonight, right now, I'm just doing my thing. And I, and I do live streams, so it's, it's difficult for me. See, I, I, King had said something and I missed it. Now I'm speeding. You're speeding a little bit, not the big deal. So what's happening is we're going down by half a percent. Oh. I even missed that. So this is the dynamic brakes. We're going through boron, I can tell. So another trick, although it doesn't work for going down downhill too much, I'm having a hard time getting slowing down here. If you need, oh, there we go. Control C, like Control C, Control V, slow speed control. I said I'm the king of Barstow. Ha ha. Stole my job. <laughs> So when you're going downhill, uh, that speed control will not work. You got you got to be ready to use the brakes. It won't. Uh, it won't. Uh, so yeah, there's an industry off that way, North American. Okay. So here here's how this speed control thing works, though. We're we're going flat right now, so. So I'm gonna I'm gonna start giving it. So yeah, you gotta watch the grades and all that other stuff. One of these days I might do a grade chart. I got I got so many different things. I wanted to add trains this weekend. We had trains that aren't working, so I had to delete some instead of adding them. Ah, oh, for crying out loud! Jesus, Murphy. Hello. begin and the guilt trips oh. those tests don't work for shit 
He was getting negative test, negative test, negative test. So I guess I won't be seeing him for 10 days. Or some horseshit. Because I don't have... Not, he doesn't have it and I don't have the, uh, the thing. He's doing fine. He's had a uh, bit of mild symptoms or whatever. All right, so I'm gonna have to uh, do an email in a little bit. I'm not worried about it right now. So, yeah, and I'm not worried about the COVID thing either. So, he's doing fine. I was wondering what that was all about. So. Oh boy, he finally got it. Now he'll be immune. Wonder if I had it. Cause I had like what felt like a um like a canker sore in the back of my throat. No, no, I might have gave it to him. But I feel, but I feel fine. He's been, he's been having low-grade fevers. But he's had tests like a few times now. So, let's see. I'm thinking about buying a rail control also seems that makes the game easier. Uh, it's called a rail driver. They're hard to find. I don't know if they're so easy to get anymore, but uh, yes, it does. Highly recommend it, especially if you enjoy this. There you go. So I'm just in the chat talking about uh, the COVID. I think you'll be fine. I'm not worried about it. It's probably a good thing that he got it because now he get he gets the uh, the antibodies. Not sure how he got it. He could have got it through school or whatever. He was just down here a few minutes ago. Just want to make sure he's okay. Hi, is he there? Oh, you don't want to talk to me? 
I just want to see if he's okay. Oh yeah. No way. Hi. Oh, I see. Oh, he's isolated. You can't even go near him. You're get, you're gonna get it. Well, no, 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 no. You won't get it. You're you, you're. Uh... Oh, I know that. I know that. You'll be you'll be fine. You'll be fine. No, that's that's fine. You can take. As far as I know, ten. But I will. Uh, I will. I will leave that up to my supervisor. I will. I, I will let her know tonight. Oh, I. Sorry, I'm gonna mute this, guys. <laughs> Okay, sorry guys. Just, uh, he's, uh, being locked up in his room. <laughs> uh, bring him downstairs with me. course she won't let me she won't uh, let him down here now so I won't see him for 10 days Ugh. oh well the test was going negative 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 these rapid test things I hear you can drop orange juice on these things and they do it but anyways I don't want to talk about COVID I'm so sick of talking about COVID Everybody's talking about war now, so. <laughs> Anyways, let's have fun. Um, of course, you know, it's your kid. You get you worry about things, but they'll be fine. Like the sunsets here. So we're gonna run till right till eleven o'clock tonight. Edwards Air Force Base sighting. I haven't run into there yet. Never switched that. Back when I did the Boron Local, we didn't use Edwards. I don't think it's had cars in years, but... <laughs> Ooh, I better put the heat on. Uh, what signal we got here? Clear signal? Cool. Be right back. I'll have 
have to hit the alerter <laughs> or run for it. I just gotta get my heater. Uh, reach for the alerter. There we go. I kind of wanted some time off from work. The problem is I'm the only one that... Uh, actually, I wanted to take vacation on March break, so... <laughs> of course, I got a working vacation because I will be online and doing whatever I can to help. Tell you what, I'll do this. I'll just go blind for a second. I'm still with you guys. I just want to send it an email. Sorry, I can't see uh, what's going on right now. There we go. Let's, let's turn this back on here. I'll do game capture for a second. Oh, that doesn't work. Clear signal. Missing the sunset. There we go. I sent an email off to my supervisor. Hmm. Heart rate's up a little bit. I'm more, as much as I'm concerned about him, I'm actually concerned, uh, I'm, I'm actually concerned for my colleagues at work because they got to take over for me. 
I know how to do my job, but unfortunately the person that they hired, uh, he is, uh, he's pretty green. <laughs> so, he's, he's going to be struggling to say the least. And that's not being, you know, that that's not that's not taking COVID lightly with my son. I I'm not worried about it. If he had bad symptoms, I'd be a little bit more worried. But it's um, Omicron has been very light. Uh, the odds of what it does to kids and all that other stuff. It was never a question that he was going to get COVID or I was going to get COVID. We always knew that. He is not vaccinated. Neither am I. He's 13 years old. I'm not vaccinated. I decided I didn't want to. That was my choice. That's his choice. It is what it is. We know our risks. We know we know we know the risks, rewards, blah blah blah. So I don't wanna get into a philosophical discussion about why I should have or shouldn't have and all that stuff. There's no regrets. We made our bed, we lie in it. It is what it is. Hey, Sean. The sun's going down behind the mountains. See the weather changed? Notice we just got into a different uh, weather pattern suddenly. Kind of happened abruptly, but... I mean, the sun went down, but it just got gray. Like I said, Mojave had rain earlier today. So we're going down at uh, I dropped off the throttle because I'm anticipating it picking up. Putting the dynamics on looks like it, I like looks like I'll be pulling over to a siding. Well, it's for Canada. I believe it's it looks like I got a forty mile an hour reduction, so I am going to take a siding. Uh, it's five days if you're unvaccinated. Ten, sorry, five days if you're vaccinated. Ten if you're unvaccinated. I fall in the ten. Whoa! That happened quick.
Not that I have to close the windows, but... What's the temperature today, anyways? 72. Yeah. Okay. Step lights on. I don't think I need. Wow! I don't think I need my cabin lights on. I mean, I can turn them on, but. Nah, I don't need them. Heard a detector in the distance. This <laughs> guy with a cardboard tree comment. <laughs> oh boy. It's raining, but it's beautiful. I love it. I got the very realistic uh, rain too. It doesn't it doesn't do any take. I, I keep my frame rate at thirty. I don't care about that. Talk about American Truck Simulator. And, you know, it wouldn't be that. Listen, I mean, if American Truck Simulator had this type of scenery, I would still get it. Would this be better with better scenery? Sure, it would. Of course not. You know, but I want good playability too. You don't get a one-to-one -one, uh, world in American Truck Simulator, so it's like comparing apples to oranges, so... I think this... <coughs> pardon me. I think the scenery is fine the way it is. No, I can't really stick my head out the window. I'm not supposed to. That's like sticking it through glass. <laughs> My ex aunt uh, just called. She's been oh, like I ain't talking to her. They she she tried to give me the massive guilt trips and. Jackie's gonna be all friggin' worked up upstairs. All this friggin' fear over COVID. Uh, who's that? There's somebody here. The switch air. Is he coming to join me? Nope. Thought I saw him. Oh, here comes my train. Never tell when the damn bell's on this thing.
Hey, Switcher's on my engine. There he is. There he is. Hi, Switcher. So, yeah. <coughs> oh, boy. Now I'm coughing. <coughs> so, uh, yeah. So, oh, geez. I better uh, slow off a little bit here. Uh-oh. That's not good. I had an oopsie. Mm. That hurt. I was too busy watching Switcher. <laughs> See, if I can make a mistake. All right, you hit F7. That that brings all the brakes back. And then F7 is supposed to bring back the brakes. Uh oh. Do I still have my? Oh. I thought M7. Oh, um, what am I hitting? Oh, I'm hitting F11. F7, there we go. I was hitting F11. So that was a bad thing. Yeah, I'm supposed to go through a red light. That's right, play me. <laughs> so see, it's okay. It's a, it's okay to make mistakes. Now, sh should I have been paying more attention? Was that thunder? I haven't seen lightning yet, so I think that's the sun. Okay. Well, that was adventurous. So, Star 13 is uh, we're on BM BNSF right now. Let's see if he gets me shit for going through the. Uh... <laughs> it's not my first time. Waiting for one. Ah. Why am I waiting for that one? I'm a Z train. <laughs> Go walk out in the rain. Damn, this sky is ominous. I love it. Hey, aliens? See, when I go like this, it looks like I see flashing, but it's... I don't know, it's some weird effect. You better have a signal. I think you do. He only has me lit up to here! Come on! Give me a signal. So yeah, you can you can you can have fun with him too. I'll, I'll show you. So this is this is his sense of humor. So you go like this.
I need faster windshield wipers. Now watch. I heard you the first time. He, he, he'll say all kinds of man. That that's that's the most uh, that is a, that is a heavy rain shower. Eh, looks like it was earlier. Mm -hmm. What my train looks like. Domestic stuff, FedEx. Some trailers. F for flashlight if you want to. F12 if you want to anchor, shift F12 if you want to fly, you can go like this, you can fly all over the place, you can transport, you can do all kinds of things. You want to take a cool picture. Uh, look at look at Otto, Otto being feisty. Okay, if you want to get rid of your chat to take a pic picture, just remember you got to turn it back, control tab. That gets rid of it. Then you can hit F8. Uh, oh yeah, you want to take get rid of these things. Control 8. Switcher's there, that's okay. He can stay. There's a way to get rid of him too. Uh, or like those pictures or whatever. But he's still there, he's patiently waiting. And then you control tab to get everything back on. Shift Z gives you your little thingamajig up there. And then uh, If you want to come back in to transport back to yourself, this is this is my idea, by the way. They used one of my ideas. Shift one, position save. So you can posi you can save a bunch of positions, like two, three, four, five. You can up to up to five. So let's say one. Okay. So we're at position one, right? And you want to go check out, do some rail fanning while you're waiting for this clown. Uh, where is he anyways? He's like, come on! He's not even in the approach block. Okay. I'm going to Barstow and check what's going on here. So, if you wanna, wanna go see, see what King's, did I see a flat? Is that, did I see it? Did I see flashing? Or is that just daylight coming back? Cause it was sunny here before. Yeah, see, it's 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 daylight coming back. So this is Barcelona. Yeah, you see, that's he, he's honk, he, somebody's honking. Oh, he's honking because he's just about to go. Yeah, that's how the weather changes. So this is what it looks like earlier. Um. But uh, and you can transport to various people. So he's on the hump. So I can transport to select a train. And there he is. So he's getting ready to run a hump. That's, uh, King's doing that. Uh, anybody else? Oh yeah, the switcher. Well, the switcher's beside me, but I don't know. He has YBKBK. If he wants it. Quincy's a rail fan. Uh, Chubby Turtle's a rail fan. Rail fan or riding or conductor or whatever. These are all the engines that have been fueled up and ready. This is our service area, which, you know, in case you have breakdowns. You can repair and fuel anywhere now. I hate it. I liked it better when you could have it go to the shop. Like it instantaneously fuels now. I don't like that. Okay, control one to go back. See, control one goes back. 
and then I go back in. Now the, I, there's no rain right now. Give it a minute. Give it a second. It's just gotta it's gotta respawn all the weather. Um, let me check my chats here. It's just blowing up here. What's going on? What's going on? See, told you it was gonna pick up. He's got the he's got the bork scenery. Okay, I had the bork scenery. You need to have the Bakersfield sub, and if you don't have the Bakersfield sub, you don't have the assets. You can uh, you can bug uh, Run Eight. They might help you. Um, they were able to help me, but uh, I'm not saying that they can help you. I'm just saying they could possibly if they have time or whatever but they will fix it they're good about fixing uh, various issues so and I'm a Z train and I'm waiting well of course I had to go into emergency so had I not gone into emergency I might have been okay oh see that it went flashing yellow and green so he's getting closer he's getting closer Maybe he's in the approach block by now. Well, I guess I can stay up later now, since I'm not, I'm probably not driving to work. Hey guys, uh, that means I can have the server on later this week. It means I start later too, but you know. Gotta love that COVID, huh? Seriously? Seriously what? But you're borked? You're borked. You can you can reinstall run aid and not put the update in. You'll be fine. It's all good. Okay, so where do we wanna where do we wanna go bug? How far is away is this guy? Oh, he's coming up to Mojave. The rain seems lighter here. Alright. Alright, he's coming up to Mojave. It's not too bad. Here, I'll turn the lights on for Switcher. Oops, wrong one. Window heater, how about that? Cabin light. Come on, Switcher, talk to me. You just looking. Switcher. <laughs> uh, switcher, open your window. Wish I could throw something at him. Ah, oh, too bad.
<laughs> I wanted to throw a I wanted to throw a flare at him in the cab, but it didn't work. Now, now, let's clean up our, let's clean up our, uh, M.O.W.s. Jesus. Okay. What do you do when you're waiting for a train? Hey, knock it off. Say it placed a yellow flag. What'd you do with that one? What the hell's that one? Jesus, I couldn't even get to it. No, you can only place them. Fun little thing they added for version 3. They're kind of cool. Alright, he's on the approach. throw some money at the problem? Uh, you can get Bakersfield, but depends what you have. I wouldn't I, I mean, Bakersfield's okay. I don't have Bakersfield myself. So all these track things here, this is this is the hump my hump tracks going. I think it only shows on the server and the client, but I'm not positive. So what happens is when we when we go through um, actually while I'm sitting here let me just let me just check my uh, email real quick. I'll be right back. I was just thinking that. Emmett's uh, email me.
Just damn it. Emmett's emailing me, but I don't want to read a lengthy email right now. I'll read it uh, afterwards. Whoops. We don't see any of that, Sean. Oh, okay. So that's just a server side thing. Here comes the train. Let's just double check. Yeah, they're gonna hold it. Well, I, ah. Hi. Hi. Oh, I'm doing okay. I'm just streaming. Sorry, I didn't read your long messages. I got a train passing by. I was Switcher and I were throwing uh, flares at each other. Say, okay, all right. Was there was there anything in the email that you needed to talk to me about, or yeah, I, yeah, I'll I'll read that later. But you you can talk to me. I'm live streaming right now. So any, anything anything you want to tell uh, everybody? Everybody's all worried about you. Yeah, he's fine. Yeah, every yeah. So, no, I know you'll be fine. Well, you 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 know what your you know what your mom said too is you you that you still have to get vaccinated and all this if you have COVID. Play it up that you have COVID. That's what I'd do. Way to go! Take the Gatorade. Uh, that a boy. <laughs> So you had you, you had the Gatorade before you took that? Right. Oh, I see. Yeah, I know because of the acid thing. Take a take another test tomorrow. Out of your cell. Tell your mom that. Tell your mom you she, you can come down. Tell your mom I'm okay if you want to come down here. Probably ten. Who knows? It's not your fault. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Hey, you could have had it for a while. It could have been something. It could have been a false test. Don't, don't, don't worry about it. No, I know. I know you're not. Of course. Yeah, well, um, yeah, you, you got a warm week coming up, so make sure you, man, you, you gotta, you gotta, you, you gotta be able, uh, Emmett, I'll talk to your mom, but you gotta be able on some of the better days to at least get outside. No. No, it's not. Oh, there you go. Yeah, you 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 should be fine. And and, and as far as your mom goes, as long as she's as as, as long as you don't touch anything and uh, you wear a mask. No, no, you don't need you don't need to wear a mask right now. I know she. Oh, she doesn't. All you, all you have to do. You, she has a mask on. You have a mask on. Like I don't know why you're, you're separated in a room. That's ridiculous. Mm. Who 
knows? Just uh, do me a, do me a favor. You got some nicer days coming up. Open open your window. What? Okay. Well then, good because you got a nice day coming. You got some nice days, and 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 talk to talk to your mom about getting outside. You don't have to be around people. You can be in the backyard. Try to get some exercise. Try to get some exercise. Yeah, exactly, exactly. You're not. You're not. You're not going to give the plants COVID. She can wash it off. Oh. I ain't worried about I'm I'm not doing it I'm not doing it I'm not I'm not doing any of that and she can't force me she can't force me to do anything I mean it's bad enough that you I'm not allowed to see you but hey what <laughs> Oh, you can't. You don't even have. Oh, uh, no, you don't have. See if you can get. Well, you got the computer at least. So, uh, uh, see if you can get. Um, uh, see if you can get uh, raw tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow night, Monday night raw. Cody might show up. Oh, okay. All right. I'm sorry. What was that? Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, I should let you go for now. I'm gonna. I'll stream for the rest of them. I'm still streaming. I'm just running. I'm running. I got. I. I made it to Mojave. It's pouring. Yeah. Remember, it was rain. Well, it went from sunny. It went from sunny. It was a beautiful sunset, and then all of a sudden the clouds came in, and boom. So. Oh yeah, fun stuff. Okay. Anyways, you take care and talk to you talk to me whenever you want. All right. Love you. Bye. He's fine. Seems okay, but not tested. Uh, oh, okay. Yeah, I... I don't know. Hey, everything's been fine. Uh, like, I've, I've got quite a bit of traffic right now. Things are fine. Oh. Hold on. Hello. Yes. Yes. No, 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 no. I said uh, to ask you. I said, I, I said, he can come downstairs because he, I pro whatever he has, I have. I don't wear a mask around him. So, no, no. I'm, I'm just saying. I, 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 I'm not overriding you. If, if you want him up there, that's your, that's your choice. Okay. 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 Okay, you, you, it's okay. It's okay. I, 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 I said what I would allow. But no, I'm not trying to override you. That's you're, you're the boss when it comes to him as far as that kind of thing. But it's it's okay. It's okay. No, that's 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 fine. That's fine. What I did say though, Jackie, what I what I what I did say is he you you know what cabin fever is, right? Okay, he should have the ability to at least go into the backyard. Okay, as long as we agree on that, that's cool. Awesome, awesome, okay, good. That's, that's okay, that's, that, that, that's, that's fine too, or he can walk and keep plenty of distance, you know what I mean? Because it's going to be some nice days out and, I, and he could really use the fresh air. 
no, I, that's fine. No, it's all cool. No, don't worry, don't don't worry about it. I'm, I, we're we're fine. I, I I just said I'm okay with it. I didn't tell him. No, no, you that you're you're the boss upstairs. No, I wouldn't. No, it's okay. It's 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 okay. No, and and and, and she, he know, he should know that. It doesn't matter what I said. No, I understand. Oh, yeah, that's fine. I I'll I'll never. I don't have any, but uh, I've I've uh, reached out to my um, supervisor. I'm waiting re for a reply, and uh, yeah. Don't worry about it. You take you. They have them. If they want me to have one, I'll go into work. I do have to leave for groceries and all that other stuff. I'm probably gonna get them online. I have to. I I I have to. I have no choice. But I'll probably order them online just to, just as a safety precaution. So, and I go through drive throughs anyway, so, no. No. Yeah, it'll be fine. That's fine. You know, just take, take some added precautions, and, uh... One, one thing, too, um, one thing, too, that he said... Oh, you're on my live stream, by the way. Anyways, <laughs> it's okay. Um, we're, we're driving. They get, they get to see the train. Um, the, uh... He had uh, the, this Gatorade. Um, there has been. He had that Gatorade. So just just so you know, and I'm not I'm not say, saying anything. He should have a, he should try another test eventually. Well, because it could have been a false positive. No 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 no. Positives can be false positives. Like you know the accuracy of those things. Okay. Mm-hmm. No, no, I, I, I understand that. I, I, I understand he got a positive, but... I, I... I know, I know. But a positive can be a false positive, too. You can have false positives and you can have false negatives. No, that's that's why the act... Yeah, 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 yeah. You, yeah because you save your test for yourself and, uh, you know, he'll be fine. He's, he can't go to school anyways. Yeah. Oh, well, there you go. See? So, hopefully he helps. Yeah. Well, as long as, as long as he gets to have some exercise in that, then, then, that's, that, then. Air, air is fine. Cold, cold is, cold air doesn't gonna hurt. No, he, he'll be fine. Okay. All right, I'll let you go. All right, thanks. Talk to you later. Bye-bye. There we go. Yeah, I said he can come downstairs. I didn't say. I didn't say. I was I wasn't overriding her. So we're separated, but she's my landlord. <laughs> Just in case you're wondering, he's upstairs, kind of locked in his room right now. But he's got all the stuff he needs up there. So he's he says he's fine. And it's supposed to be a nice week this week, so we both agree that uh, yeah, he can. He should be able to go outside. He doesn't want him going for a walk and all that other stuff, but I said, you know, I said it's fine as long as he keeps separated, but fresh air will do him good. Lots of vitamins, and, and he should have another test because he had, um, he had, uh, I, I've heard stuff like citrus and Gatorade and stuff like that just knocks the crap out of those things. It'll actually give you a false positive, but looks like we got a train coming. So now we're climbing. Uh, we just went through Mojave through all that, and we are climbing. I was probably speeding through the uh, the junctions there. Okay. Now you have to. I can. I can dim it for a second, but then I have to brighten it for the, uh... You see, he's gonna dim it, but... I have to keep it on as I'm approaching. Which is the rule. Ah, we got Manifest Train going to West Colton. I got a 35 mile an hour reduction coming up. 
Hopefully you guys like this. Anyways, um, no, I, we'll watch the train here go by. Switch her around? I guess he left. Trying to tell how much I can't really see with the with the rain. Oh, 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 whoops! There we go. I turned the dynamic that went red because I had the dynamic brakes on. I'm gonna reset the speed control once I hit that speed limit moving up. Oh yeah, you have. Um, So, um, yeah, the, what happens is at Daggett, um, well, I don't know about Slover. I don't have, I don't think I have Slover, do I? But, um, at Daggett, what happens is anything for the Cajon sub gets stuck at that signal anything for the Mojave sub let's will make it through or the passenger station we found that out tonight I was trying different symbols although Watt for some reason I I don't there's a lot of weird stuff about it Watson for some reason seems to be fine and I don't know why now there is a fix guys um, So yeah, I, I, I just um, repeated that uh, in chat because I, I um, that's what uh, I've, I've been told. Uh, it's contrary to what we've been told all along, but apparently that fixes it. I haven't tested that yet. For now, you know, I'm just waiting to to see what officially is going to be done because I, I I don't want to keep on changing my symbols I'd rather I'd rather add the other symbols first um, because my only run for for Cajon sub right now is just um, traffic that goes from one spawn point to one end point over Barstow that's the only place I have it for example this is it comes out of here goes out of here he's done that's his, that's the whole travel for him um, why I prefer to use now I can even do a smaller region if I wanted to <clears throat> uh, 
system, but I decided to use a uh, what I call a seven to one um, a seven to one slow clock. So I'm just reading the chat here. Oh. Okay, switcher. Yeah. I don't know. That's what I was told, but if it doesn't work, who knows. I ain't worried about it. As long as my Mojave... As long as my Mojave trains are working, then that's fine. Um, oh yeah, and then there's uh, little displays here. Uh, there's little buttons that you can... I forget what the key commands are, but there's... Uh, you got various displays here. It depends on the engine, of course. Uh, local monitors. Um, you do have engine failures that will help you. Your EOT markers on, blah, blah, blah. There's the stats. So we're coming up to a 25 mile an hour zone. So it says reduction 35 and then 25. I don't know what the what the hell that means. UP detector milepost 377.0 track 2. Yeah, sounds good, switcher. Keep us posted. I know you will. I am broadcasting, correct? Yes, I am. That right there, that right control, that's the industry uh, markers. I don't believe they work in client right now, but uh, they work in single player. Right control F8. Okay. So it says 35 and then 25. I see a 35. So where's the 25? Well, according to that, I'm supposed to be in the 35 zone, so I don't know what the hell's going on. Yeah, I'm in the 35 zone now. Now I'm in the 25 zone. That's weird stuff. Okay. Yep. And that's uh, newer for version 3, is seeing a lot more traffic. <laughs> Whereabouts are you, Quincy? Ah, oh, you're a Z train. <laughs> Donato <laughs> Meat Wagon. <laughs> You got a lot of tra traffic. So I think that's Quincy there, the Z train. He wanted to be a Z train too. Uh, any other? No. Oh, there's a train. Sorry, dude. Cute train. Kind of looks like me.
Yeah, I see it. I see where you're at now, Quincy. It's an auto train. Yeah, I think he gets uh, he gets intermodal speed. Problem is, it's it, it, the the Mojave sub is very busy right now. I've I've had to wait three times now, even though I'm a Z train. I was uh, we were first sitting we were first sitting at uh, just outside it was at Valley Junction whatever the hell that next one is on the Mojave sub and then we had uh, Hinkley and then we did uh, Emmett and I did a crew change at one of them and then I had a wait at uh, Sanborn I think, was, I think it was Sanborn or whatever who's this. I haven't had death threats yet. <laughs> See, Emmett, Emmett didn't want to have the uh, the vaccination, and I agreed with him. So I stood beside him on that one, and because we're separated, I backed him up. And no, because he has COVID right now, I'm not uh, worried about it. I'm not worried about all that. I'm not going to, you know, if people start guilt tripping me or whatever the stuff is. His symptoms are very light. He should be fine. And I hope this is COVID. I hope this is, this is the one and done and goodbye. Because he'll have natural immunity. And I believe for the most part most immunity should be 21 years is what they're saying I don't know why they come with 21 but that's what I've heard so hopefully I got it hopefully hopefully uh, you know I'm one and done and uh, that'd be fine by me I haven't been tested in a while like those rapid test things it's probably a false positive, though, to be honest. I don't know, though. He's had symptoms, so who knows those stupid rapid tests. UP detector milepost 377.0, track 1. Which container size is the correct one? Huh? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I, I just I just bought the I just bought a bunch of forties. They look pretty cool. Problem is I don't have forties on any of these trains, so I I gotta start adding trains. Hey, oh yeah, I'm home. I'm home this week. I'm probably home this week. Well, actually, I'm not seeing Emmett, so that means my whole schedule changes. Good thing I got run eight. I'd, I'd be going nuts right now. And I'll miss him when we get to talk. <laughs> and I'm not tired tonight. That's amazing. Well, that's because the clock's changed. So it's like 9.50 old time. Yeah. Whoops, don't want that. What kind of traffic I got coming at me? Okay, I got one little manifest. I'm cleared to Tehachapi right now. There he goes. 
<laughs> See, I've had what feels to be like a canker sore in my throat now. It's been dying down for a while. So who knows what the hell that is? It's canker sore as far as I'm concerned, but... I'm sure as hell not going to a doctor's office. It's been getting better, so... I'm just going to check my mail real quick. Oops. Okay, coming back on. <laughs> can't even read the hours. Sean, it looks like the Mojave line from the grade through Bakersfield is jammed up. That's fine. It looks fine to me. I'm trying to figure out what trains have been, like how many eastbounds we've had versus westbounds. I'm gonna probably gonna dial it back a bit. We've got 18 trains on right now. Um, AI status. Yeah, where the hell is it? Oh, not that. I'll 
put it up to 30. Let's see what happens. The average should be about 10, but I think I think that's playing it about as safe as I can. Yeah, it's better not to have clocks if you if you don't need them. I'd be out in the woods somewhere. I mean, I like my internet access, but <laughs> that's the only thing I would miss. But well, hopefully I'd have it. But I'd spend more time in the outdoors. That's for damn sure. Oh. <sighs> Although I don't spend much time in the outdoors as it is right now, but, yeah, to get warmer clothing. This week, i hopefully be out. Uh, that's what at least I'm planning on it. Looks like I have a yellow. No, oh, I have a green. Okay. Oops. Let's say I thought I saw a train. Yep. I think that's a train. Can't tell for sure, but. So it's 11 Eastern, normally I would shut down right now, but I don't feel like it. <laughs> ah. Thirty more minutes. Because it looks like I'm going to have to go into work. that the rain stopped. So yeah, when he means get bar gal out of here. Uh, am I broadcasting right now? I can never remember. Oops. So that's the train he's talking about right there. I'll, t I'll explain more about that in a minute. So, we, uh, this is our weekly schedule. Now, you'll notice the simulated times, but this is for a full week. 
and we've already ran these this morning and all this other stuff. These are all the manifest trains. Those are, those are the ones that you will see that are coming out. Oops. raining I can uh, I can open the windows now get some fresh air there we go back on the hill I see some stars, that's a good sign. Is that a 70 marker? Cool. I see the highway. Another advantage of having an intermodal train is you you get some of the top uh, the upper speed limits. minimize this again one more time sorry guys no new messages I'll check and get it half past there we go we're 70 miles an hour oh sorry turn you guys back on turn it on turn off no turn it on turn off something like that cool Now, of course, going uphill and going downhill are two different things. Going downhill, I might have time to show you guys, hopefully. Let me see, where are we at here? So I'm about to get to Summit, so yeah, we'll have time. That uh, next train should get out of my way, and then... Yeah, everything on the hill is running fine. Uh... far as I know. I'm just trying to figure out what that other guy is doing. I don't know why they didn't put him in the vehicle, but they did. They didn't, so their choice. I think what's going to happen is the uh, once the train passes at, uh, southeast at Allard then everything will do its thing. That's my guess. Okay, I'll stop looking at that.
Excuse me. That's uh, the uh, Smith Plant Monolith. I switched uh, all those cars in there last time. We tend to have our little favorites, I guess. Now, I did run an SJVR train last night for the first time since uh, uh, getting version 3 going in the server and RTS and all that other stuff. But... Um, so that was cool. The horn also uh, stops the alerter. Love that highway. I forget what I was going to say. Oh yeah, so we kind of have our like switcher. He likes running SJVR Bakersfield type area. Uh, King, for example, he likes running uh, uh, Barstow. I I I I go all over the place, but I tend to I like doing Barstow a little bit. I like to do them all really. Um. That's the thing. I mean, I, I, I'll fill in whatever is needed. I wasn't too worried about that outbound. I already did, did a fair amount. This, well, not a fair amount, but I did enough this morning. So, Okay, so we're down to 23 mile an hour zone and 2.9 miles. Coming up to Summit. This is the Summit. I think right here. Yep, that's Summit Siding. I feel I feel fruity enough problem is this is going to start like right now I'm still going uphill even though the summit summits kind of like the actual summit is right about here so in two miles I gotta get down to 23 Oh yeah, he does the bore on local too. That's not a bar stow though. I call that bar stow. I do Mojave, it seems. So far. I usually run the uh, uh, LOP 53 to Mojave AI it, because it's a boring trip. <laughs> and, uh,. Then I'll do the all the LOQ53 stuff and, and uh, well I'll do whatever switching LOP53 has to do on the way, but I'll AI it. That's uh, chem tool I think I can't remember. Another one of the industries we switch. Okay. So you go independence and then oh I'm 
going way too fast. Now I'm going to put full application of brake. So I'm going way too fast. What else is new? There's my 23 mar marker right there. Now I'm not going to derail or anything, but... Not putting it in an emergency. Okay, so now I release the brakes. I'm down to 23. And then I'm going to take the dynamic off. Because I'm about to stop. More than likely. Nope. There we go. So that's a controlled slowdown. The rear's got 84 pounds. That's this uh, indicator right here. That's what the EOT is showing. Uh, chambers being filled back up again. Or the flow is coming, I should say, for the reservoir. We're okay. So how do you go downhill? So we got 15 minutes, I can show you this. Put the dynamics on. Minimum brake. So what happens here is the minimum, the minimum set brake, which is here, that's a seven pound application allows you to keep the speed see you see how we're going like 23 so now I can dial it up a bit so the dynamic lever gives you control it gives you more precise finesse control over your downgrade so there's nothing to fear about it now what I just did was I threw all my air in now that's okay because as long as you're coming to it, you realize you might come to a stop and you might have to refill all your air. Now, fortunately, I wasn't sitting there and I was I sure as hell wasn't going to throw it into an emergency because it wasn't an emergency situation. It was just me, you know, not slowing down fast enough. But right now I'm in a controlled descent. I'm going down to my uh, 1.5 grade, which is not the biggest uh, grade. Um, there's there's fast there's a little bit harder ones coming up uh, around cliff or so, uh, but still, yeah, I got an approach signal coming up. So at cable, I have to uh, stop. I may even AI the train there. I'll show you how to do that. Depends. We'll see how much traffic we got. Starting on a hill's another thing you have to, you know consider. Now, I don't have a train to start on a hill tonight. Um, if you're afraid of doing it, you don't have to have a train that goes up a hill. Or, sorry, goes, um, yeah, up a, hill, up a hill. Now, I just went up a hill. I didn't have to stop. Maybe I should have stopped at Cameron or something just to show you. It's not a big deal. It is a bigger deal when you have a manifest train. With an intermodal train, not a big deal. Manifest train, you're going to have to uh, be very patient. So this is what I usually do for the server. Like, I would shut it down at 11 o'clock, but because of all the... Uh, I, you know, I, I, it's 30 minutes. It's a Sunday night. We just had the, the time shift and all that other crap, so there's a little tone in the background. Somebody's calling the dispatcher. I'm 
half a mile away from the next signal, so I'm going to go full dynamics now. Now going to, we're going down two percent now. So I'm I'm feeling, I'm feeling the uh, the uh, uh, I don't know the kind of the G force. It's it's you don't feel the physical G force, but you you, you see a bit of a shaky motion once in a while. That's just me playing around with the dynamics. I'm just getting it more controlled, so I'm ready to stop coming up. I know cable, uh, that signal, or a cable crossover, I should say. Cable crossover is right around the curve here. So I need to be in control. I don't feel like dumping the air again. Now, I was on BNSF earlier, now I'm on UP. I, I came on to the UP at Mojave. So this is the UP Mojave sub. Uh, BNSF has uh, rights all the way to Bakersfield. So now I'll stick my head out the window. Here comes a train. Let's see, I can still see the speed in here. There's the red signal right there. I swear I saw, saw a light, but maybe it's something else. Okay. Oh yeah, there's a train coming at me. I, I don't know why he's in my way. Should have took him at the cable and put him on. They, they, they do some weird stuff sometimes, but... Let's see the light up ahead. Do I want to relinquish him? Do I, do I, do I? So this is a very controlled descent, even though I'm full dynamics. I only have minimum set. I can I can give more air. I can uh, use the independent. I can use my independent brake, which is the front brake in the engine, if I wanna if I wanna come to a stop. I can use the independent to start slowing me down a bit too. See, just like that, or I can let it go. But I will, I'll slow it down a bit. I don't want to lose it though. So the object right now is to not stop. Even though I just did. Looks like my tail end just did anyways. I heard a beep. Yeah, we'll stop. Do I want to, well, I mean, I got a lot, eh, you know, I think I will relinquish. So this is what you do. I'm going to take this guy here, and I'm going to AI him. You click on him, you AI recruit, you're done for the night. You shouldn't be flashing your headlights at him, buddy. But he is. That's not nice. Usually they dim it, but... P 
apparently I wasn't close enough. Okay guys, eight minutes. See me, I wouldn't dim it now. I like to watch the I like to see the uh Oh, see, look at that. Those are the, the AI drivers. Where's your buddy? Oh there he is. It's a me, a Mario. No. Um. Is the moon out somewhere tonight? Ah, there you are. Cool. Can I zoom in on you? There we go. Where am I? Oh. Did I miss any cars? Yeah. <laughs> you know, higher foamers. No. It's okay. I don't know what the 10-4 was. I missed it. Oh, it must have been response to me. Yeah, oh, there's the first shot of the night. Good timing. So there's a lot of action. This is, this is, I mean, what I was doing in my last days a couple years ago, version 2, is I was running these trains, but I was dispatching them, and I was, it was just miserable. When you're, yeah, don't get me wrong. I love dispatching, but I don't like dispatching and trying to run every train out of there. All right, King. See ya. Oh, and uh, did you get that train out? Ah, uh, you didn't get that train out, or did he? I don't know. We'll go check in a minute. In a few minutes. He said he was going to be able to get it out. If not, I'll do it in the morning. Not a big deal. Okay, so there's like a 20 second wait. There it is. So he's got his light. Oh, you did. Oh, you didn't. Oh, you just did it. See? It's gone. So yeah, he's that. there he is there. He just changed that to yes. So if I was to say, if I was to go to this one, and if I was to go yes, that would disappear. And that's tomorrow's at midnight. This will turn green. These ones will turn yellow. So this is the ones we got like tomorrow. So at 11 o'clock in the morning, we got I got to spawn in a mod, mod bar, or somebody does, and uh, then the next train coming out is a barbell. So what happens is over a bar stow. Oh, see you, Quincy. So there's my train. Here we'll go take take a quick look, fast look at it. We got about four minutes here. 
so the way Barstow works, and this is this is this feeds all the industries. I haven't even gone to locals. If you want to see the locals? I ran. The locals are a lot of fun, and you can you can help uh, crews if you're new and you know. You can run with the crew, and uh, you can talk in teams or not team speaking. You can talk in Discord if 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 uh, you know if you have a friend who's uh, more experienced or is willing to uh, take you on. You know, and you can you can meet a lot of a lot of cool friends here. So there's the end of uh, end of the, that train going down the hill. Um, so these pink here, that's uh, switchers. Uh, got all the, those active right now. Man, he's got a lot active. Oh, there's a transfer, and there's oh the transfer's coming in, and then there's uh, something else. But um, anyways, so if we go to Barstow, okay, the last train we probably was sitting here on South South Five, so that was the one that departed. Um, so we can look over here and this is a train that has to be hump still so the power is all off of it I showed you earlier the power that was sitting in the uh, in the uh, the fuel area here so it gets it gets fueled and then it gets uh, uh, brought over to the ready tracks. Once it's in the ready tracks, then they go out to uh, available trains for outbound. So he, he just had he just did that. Uh, over here, once you get past here, you've got the hump, which is these are the hump power right here. Goes over the hump and then it sorts into these tracks. Um, yeah, see? Tracks 1 through 26. Those are the, the various yards here. I'll keep that on for a second. Show you what's going on here. So, oops, over here, we've got the various industry codes. So these are various industries that we have and uh, uh, stuff that's in them. Uh, there, here's some here's some more local industries, and then here's some uh, some stuff for San Diego. Uh, there's still plenty of room in here for another hump. And then uh, these going into the various uh, trains that go different ways. These get trimmed, what they call trim. And then they get uh, and then they get sorted in here into this uh, looks like a meat market of uh, departures. If you need if you need more uh, time to clear, I'll, you know I can allow that. It's not a big deal. Only uh, I'll make the one exception tonight. So you got the south departure, north departure yard, and everything is it's also on the sheets as well. So in here we have uh, what everything it's come in and hostel. That's supposed you know it. And these are calculations, so you know how much HPT. Remember those HPT values? I'm like way up here to 3.7. For a manifest, you only need, you know, 2, 2, 2, 3, 2, 4. Really, we like to have 2, 4, but there's not much. And this is the number of units that are needed for the various uh, tons uh, that are there. So that's what that's all about. Um, these are all the hump tracks and what they're divided into and what they're doing and all that other stuff yada yada hey switch are you still around let me go check on them but anyways that's that's pretty much it so tomorrow for example scheduled manifest uh we have a barbell that leaves at six o'clock at night um that's not a big deal. I'm, I'm going to get... I will get to that if somebody else doesn't get to that. So you look at that. Well, what are we looking at here? We're looking at uh, stuff that's going to Bell, which I don't see much here, to be honest. 
Oh, there it is. So when you look at how much is in here, that's an okay amount. Nothing, nothing to write home about. But what would happen is still still watching. Oh, okay. So, uh, yeah, so there's a, there's a bunch right there. he's doing. He's not uh, getting the chat. So anyways, I'll see if, if he doesn't do it, I'll come transport to him and make sure he's out of the way and and what have you. But the trim here, we would we would take all those cars from Bell, the trim engines would add him to that if if they are not over capacity and they would take it okay so he's not responding so i will go i will go see what's going on here so to do that you just transport to here um might have fell asleep <laughs> oh boy these guys to restore their switches. Yeah, see that that's something you just gotta you, you gotta remember too. You got AI trains and when they start getting tied up though, fortunately there was nothing to worry about but So see the pink goes off there? Now see he's still got another one up here somewhere. I don't know what what the heck he's doing here. I don't see where the hell that is. I think that's gone. He's not, he's not responding. Get, get in 
he can give up his clearances or whatever. Cause I got I got a train right here that that won't won't uh, that's just waiting to get in. won't reply. Well, I'll have to have a talk with him. See, I don't mind. I don't mind, but you got you got to communicate. I'll let him get his train in, and then I will figure it out. So don't worry about it. It's just you got you got to be able to chat and communicate. Call 911. Well, he restored his clearances. I don't know where he did it, but he must have had another one. Because everything is restored. I'll let him stop. So, are, okay. Sorry. Are you on channel zero, uh, Turtle? Because we're going to... We're gonna relinquish. Once you once you once you cleared there, just go ahead and bring it that to a stop, if you don't mind. So yeah, you go. You, you should be on channel zero. Uh, I don't know if your radio is on something else, and that could be why. So when you when you type in the command, this this is your channel right here, the zero. So if you're on a different channel, now the other thing is control tab hides and brings up the chat. So control tab will bring that up. And see, that's what it is. That's just a communication issue. These things happen. All right. Yeah, it's possible. Had to give up the mainline clearance. No problem. We're all good. But you, but, you, but you see, see that's that's a perfect example right there. I was gonna have a talk with them. I wasn't gonna kick them or ban them or anything like that. I mean, stupid shit like that. That's stupid. So there was a communication issue. It happens. But anyways, otherwise you will be on another. Yeah, you can you can uh, you can actually uh, talk to Auto on channel zero two. But anyways, okay guys, I'm gonna shut her down. And uh, but I hope you enjoyed that. If you have any questions, uh, leave me a comment on uh, introduce yourself, whatever. Uh, we run normally, <coughs> excuse me, between seven a.m. Eastern Daylight Time. We're now in daylight. 7 a.m. Eastern Daylight Time to 11 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time. We're at like 11 to 40 right now. I gotta go to bed despite of, you know, my son having COVID and all that other stuff because I could be going to work tomorrow. Sounds like I'm going to work anyway, so. Anyways, guys, have a good one. And uh, we'll see you tomorrow. Take care. <laughs> as long as you're not dead <laughs> okay okay Barstow Mojave that's the one I want and we will exit sim okay guys that's it for now thanks for uh, checking us out error your YouTube is not receiving enough video to maintain Susie yeah, yeah whatever okay Hopefully you got all that. Have a good one, guys. Talk to you later.